steps, I think that really feel sure kind of the like OW ones, I guess. <laughs> so. In the dark room, low red light glows, outlines her gentle as a shadow. I watch her hands precise with the tongs as she turns the prints over and over. And I'm hypnotized. She glances at me with those December grey eyes, and she says she's only ever dated crazy girls before. And I wonder, how can that be possible? when she cuts her hair every, every week just to shave away her thoughts. There is a concentration here in the dark that holds me captive. I wonder how, what the shutter speed of her eyelids are, how she knows in her bones how to capture moments when her blinks last an hour, how she hangs her pictures on the nighttime washing line and turns, and her little fingers find my face. She stands on tiptoes and climbs up to my lips, and her kiss leaves a fizz in my mouth keeps my eyes closed for several blinks after, brings me back to my knees for my pale-faced smoking queen until the bell rings and we're back in reality. Uh, this one's called Little Things. Um, it's about that sort of moment where you can't really work out if someone's flirting with you or not. And you don't have the balls to ask. <laughs> <laughs> I've been noticing little things. I feel like a conspiracy theorist when I notice those little things, recurring themes, piecing it all together, but part of me doesn't want to be seen looking past the little things. You are full of little things, betraying yourself and tipping me off over and over, just little things. Just your leg, how it's against me, how it could be nothing, but it's still against me. <laughs> Little, dismissible, partially invisible things, like the way my name tastes in your mouth. Little things that pepper your speech, the eye contact, the way you ask if anyone else needs air. Well, of course I need air. Everyone needs air, but your air is not to be breathed. It's to be calculated and dissected, turned over in my mind. Little things that you have hidden for me to find, like your hand on my shoulder. The way you don't react when I wet my fingers with yours for a moment when it's almost like we're holding hands on my shoulder, just a moment. Just little things. Little, tiny, little things. And this last one's called Mr. Something Else. Out there, the dance floor is awash with rainbows, like an oil slick splashed all up on the walls only succeeds in making you look smoother when you come skidding towards me, grinning like you know, smirking like you understand. And it takes two handfuls of hips and one mouthful of kiss for the space between our atoms to evaporate. There's so much longing in those eyes that my pupils can't stretch far enough. Even my buttons whisper, yes, fucking please, straining towards you as you twirl me with ease. Maybe if I coil a little tighter, I'll wrap around your little finger because you'll miss something else. And I'm so tired of holding on to this, so even if it messes up my lipstick, just give me one real kiss and don't you dare hold back. <laughs>